A traffic light in Arizona is causing political controversy between two government offices. Yeah, Fox News' Ken Smith is more on what's causing this uproar. It's a story you'll only see right here on Fox 5. Political squabbling is brewing over here in Arizona along a stretch of U.S. 93 between the Arizona Department of Transportation and Mojave County over a new traffic light that was recently installed in the small town of White Hills, Arizona, right there at a little gas station called Last Stop. We just crossed over the border here to kind of talk about the fact that we got this new traffic light, and apparently, according to Mojave County officials, there was absolutely no public outreach involved with that new light, and they want it removed. No public outreach that we're aware of. They did, at the start of it, they asked our public works, and public works uh, said no, it wasn't a good idea, and that was the last we heard from before it went up. The lack of public outreach and transparency by ADOT is the center of the issue between Mojave County officials and the much larger and more powerful transportation agency. They've dealt with us in the past very well, so it's just surprising to me. We just can't figure it out at all why they, why they ignored us on this. According to Mojave County officials, ADOT completely ignored their repeated request for answers on why the traffic light was installed on US 93, which they describe as a, quote, freeway. The people up there weren't happy with it either, which kind of surprised me. I thought maybe they would be more supportive of a light, you know, just even though it's few people, but no, they weren't supportive of it all. Uh, they think it's dangerous. I did reach out to ADOT Communications in Phoenix, and even though they never responded to Mojave County, they did respond to us in a brief statement, quote, the traffic signal was installed and paid for by the landowner as part of a permit to build a traffic light along state property associated with a new development. A traffic signal analysis showed a traffic signal was warranted. Every vendor wants to have a stoplight in front of their location so people stop and see their, their place and, and, and increases business, but uh, that's not the way that the road department should work. According to ADOT, Last Stop Gas Station paid 100% for the new traffic light that literally forces highway traffic to stop right in front of their store. I did try to reach out to the Last Stop Gas Station to get their side of the story to respond to what Mojave County officials describe as a self-serving traffic light in the middle of nowhere. What we'll probably do next if we don't hear back from ADOT is go to our state legislature and have them put the pressure on to find out what's going on. In the meantime, while the political ping pong match continues between Mojave County and the Arizona Department of Transportation regarding the unwanted traffic light, drivers along US 93 in far northwestern Arizona will continue to stop next to the last stop gas station, whether they like it or not. I'm Ken Smith, Fox 5 News, local Las Vegas.